Hey, welcome back to SIWAR Library. Today we are going to read Sharks. This is by, I'll show you the author's name, Catriona Clark, designed by Stephen Moncrief and illustrated by Adam Relf. This is a level four in your AR. And my advice, when you type in under the search, just searching sharks, there's a lot of options that come up. This will be hard to find. I find it easiest if you type in sharks and then put the author's name, Catriona Clark. You can see the spelling there. And it comes right up. And it's a level four. So type in sharks and then Catriona Clark. Spell it like that. And it's a level four. Sharks. Who doesn't love to read about sharks? I do. All kinds of sharks. There are more than 400 different types of sharks. Some are as big as a bus and some are as small as this book. This tiger shark is twice as big as a grown man. See the tiger shark? What is a shark? A shark is a type of fish. Lots of sharks look like this black tip reef shark. These two fins help the shark to turn and swim up or down. The fins. A shark's skeleton isn't made of bone like other fish. It is made of cartilage, which is lighter and bendier. The fin on the shark's back stops it rolling from side to side fin up there. Can you see it? The tail fin helps the shark to swim quickly. Got his snout and his gills, kind of like fish have. Sharks can't swim backwards like other fish can. Oh, interesting little fact about sharks. Gill power. All animals need a gas called oxygen to live. Sharks and other fish use their gills to take oxygen from the water around them. Some sharks keep their mouths open while they're swimming to let water flow in. The shark takes in oxygen as the water flows out through the gill slits. Some sharks can breathe while they lie on the sea floor. The nurse shark can suck water into holes behind its eyes as well as into its mouth. Some sharks need to keep swimming to be able to breathe. They even swim in their sleep. Isn't that interesting? Super senses. Sharks are the best hunters in the ocean. They have very good hearing, eyesight, and sense of smell. A struggling fish caught on a fishing line makes sound waves in the water that a shark can hear from a long way away. The shark quickly moves in to attack. It snatches the fish from the fisherman's line and eats it. Sharks also have extra senses that help them to find food. All animals give off small electric signals. There are tiny holes on this shark's snout. These allow it to sense signals coming from a fish hiding nearby. Types of teeth. A shark's main weapon is its teeth. Sharks have different shapes of teeth depending on what they eat. Great white sharks have huge jagged teeth for cutting into big chunks of meat. 
sand tiger sharks. This was the great white. Sand tiger sharks have sharp pointed teeth for holding small struggling fish. It's scary looking. A horn shark has small flat teeth for cracking and grinding shells. Sharks have lots of rows of teeth. So you got one row, two row. Because you can see it. All those teeth. When one tooth breaks or gets blunt, a tooth from behind replaces it. Tiger sharks will eat almost anything. A set of bongo drums was once found in a tiger shark's stomach. Huh. Attack. Some sharks surprise their pet prey by rushing at it from below. Each year, baby albatrosses learn to fly on beaches near Hawaii, USA. Tiger sharks lurk beneath the surface, waiting for a bird to fall or land in the water. Poor babies. A shark bursts out of the water and attacks an unlucky baby albatross. Sharks sometimes attack people, but this is very rare. This surfboard was bitten by a tiger shark, but the surfer escaped. A thresher shark can use its long tail fin to hit its prey before eating it. So it gives them a nice little whopping and then eats them. Different disguises. Many sharks can hide from their prey because of the way they look. They have dark backs, which make them difficult to spot from the surface. They have pale bellies, which make them hard to see from below, too. Scientists have discovered that scalloped hammerhead sharks can get a suntan. Huh. Tasseled wobgong sharks are very well disguised. Oh, wow. It's hard to spot them in there. I'll show you the picture a little closer in a second. Their patterned skin helps them to blend in with the rocks on the sea floor. Can you spot them? Blends in very well. right there but it does blend well baby sharks baby sharks are called pups some pups hatch from eggs and some are born like other animals this is the egg case of a dogfish shark this pup will hatch out in a few months Shark pups are able to swim and hunt as soon as they are born. They don't need parents to look after them. A horn shark lays strange looking eggs that are shaped like spirals. It pushes the eggs into gaps between the rocks to keep them safe from danger. Eight months later, the pups break out of the egg cases and swim away. Across the oceans. Sharks live in all the oceans of the world. Some sharks like to stay in one place. This place is called their territory. Caribbean reef sharks live near coral reefs where the water is warm. Greenland sharks live in the icy cold water near the North Pole. Ooh, I bet that's cold. Bull sharks 
sometimes swim a very long way up rivers. If you ever watch Shark Week, I have heard where sharks have been found in the rivers before. It's the bull sharks. Blue sharks travel longer distances than most sharks. They roam the oceans looking for food. These blue sharks are feeding on tiny fish called anchovies. All heard of anchovies. Sharks of the deep. There are sharks that live far below the surface of the ocean. This is a frilled shark. Its long body makes it look like an eel. It's a very funny looking shark. Scientists do not know much about frilled sharks because they hardly ever see them. The shark above is a prickly dogfish. It has sharp spines in front of its fins. A lantern shark body glows in the darkness of the deep ocean. Gentle giants. The biggest sharks of all are also the least dangerous. They feed on small fish and tiny animals and plants called plankton. The whale shark is the biggest fish in the world. It swims just beneath the surface of the water. It feeds by swimming with its huge mouth open. It takes food from the water as the water flows out through its gills. Huh. Swims with its mouth open and eats what it catches. Whale sharks can grow to be the size of a bus. Wow, that's big. Great White Terror. The great white shark is the most famous shark. It eats big fish, seals, sea lions, dolphins, and sometimes even people. Ooh. This cage it's right here, allows a diver to stay safe while studying the shark. Can't get them in there. A great white shark can go without food for two months after it has eaten a big meal. A great white shark circles a group of seals before it moves in for the kill. The shark attacks. It thrusts its jaw forward so that it can take a huge bite. It leaps out of the water and snaps its jaws shut around the seal. Strange sharks. Some sharks look very different from the normal shark shape. A swell shark swells up its body and wedges itself between rocks so that it can't be attacked. Saw sharks have long snouts. See, it looks like a saw. They use their snouts to find prey buried in the sand. Hammerhead sharks like to eat all kinds of fish, especially rays. Stingrays. The shark uses its wide head to pin down a ray, then it bites the ray's wing. Now that the ray can't swim away, the shark can take its time to eat it. Give you a closer picture of the the hammerhead shark. Its head looks like a hammer.
sharks in danger. Millions of sharks are killed each year. Some types of shark are in danger of completely dying out if this doesn't change. Some people like to try to catch big dangerous sharks for sport. In many countries, sharks are killed for their fins, which are used to make soup. Oil leaking from ships and other kinds of pollution can poison sharks. Sharks also get tangled up in fishing nets. They die because they cannot breathe. This silky shark has been trapped in a net used for catching tuna. Uh-oh. And then you have a glossary of shark words. Do you like to... Definitions of gills. Slits on a shark's body that help it to breathe underwater. Snout. A shark's nose. Sharks use their snouts to help them find food. Prey. The fish or other creatures that a shark hunts and eats. Pup is a baby shark. Some sharks have over a hundred pups. Egg case is a hard shell that shark pups live in before they hatch. Territory is the place where a shark lives most of the time. And plankton, tiny animals and plants. Whale sharks eat plankton. The end. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button can't, so you can follow us and keep up with all the new books we'll be reading can't wait to see you next time thanks for watching